Yagi Uda antennas, which are sometimes just called Yagi antennas, consist of a single dipole antenna, which is operated within an array of other non-driven linear conductive elements, which are known as directors and reflectors. These elements are used to focus the typically symmetric radiation of the dipole antenna toward the directors and away from the reflectors. The exact number of reflectors and directors in a Yagi Uda antenna varies, but a typical design might look something like this. The reflectors are slightly longer than the dipole and are positioned behind the dipole in the opposite direction from the desired direction of radiation. The directors are slightly shorter than the dipole and are positioned in front of the dipole in the desired direction of radiation. So let's look at the effect of these additions in terms of a progression from a simple dipole to a Yagi Uda antenna. So here's a simple half-wave dipole antenna, and here's the radiation pattern resulting from its simulation. Notice that this radiation pattern is broadside from the line of the dipole and is symmetric in the phi direction. Addition of a single conductive linear element that is slightly longer than the dipole pushes the radiation away from that added element. Because of this effect, this added element is called a reflector. If we then add a second element on the opposite side of the dipole from the first, where the second element is slightly shorter than the dipole, we can see that the effect is an increased focusing of the radiation pattern. This model with a single reflector and a single director has a stronger maximum directivity than the model with only the reflector. Addition of a second director focuses the beam even further, and addition of a third director focuses the beam even further. It should be noted that there is a diminishing return with each additional element. The greatest advantage is achieved by the first added element, and progressively less advantage is achieved through each further addition. So at some point, there's no longer a meaningful advantage to increasing the number of elements. This is a typical Yagi Uda design with a single reflector and three directors. So unlike a typical dipole antenna, the Yagi Uda antenna offers a very high directivity and a very focused radiation pattern. Like dipoles, Yagi Uda antennas are narrow band and radiate with linear polarization. The electric field of the radiated wave is oriented in alignment with the dipole.